evening and welcome to this ABC 36 News update. I'm Megan Skaggs. Five days after the tornado and folks are still struggling to pick up the pieces. KU and Bluegrass Energy say all power has been restored to Madison County. At its peak, 9,200 were in the dark. FEMA could begin checking the damage as early as Friday. In Kirksville, storm-weary residents are getting some much-needed help from volunteer groups like the Madison County Rescue Squad, a group born out of a tornado outbreak more than 30 years ago. ABC 36's Carla Waite has the story. You got guys who are working for EMS. You got some guys that are just plumbers. We come from all over the county. Sergeant Bobby King's day job as a Madison County dispatcher makes him a public servant. It means everything in the world to me. Uh, I take my job a little bit more personally than I should. All of Madison County is my neighbor's one of the dispatchers. But volunteering with the Madison County Rescue Squad makes him a sight for sore eyes. Reality is really setting in right now. After five days and still so much work to do after his home was leveled by the May 8th tornado, with the arrival of the Rescue Squad, Leonard Tudor focuses on something other than the devastation around him. It's easier to work at night, so we've been doing a lot of night work trying to do cleanup. Uh, worked till about 3 this morning. Uh, slept in until about 8. <laughs> Anybody that needs a hand, all they got to do is just yell for us, and they're going to see the... You know, the suspenders, you're going to get to see the helmet and, you know, this big handsome guy coming up in your yard with an axe. The last few days, Mr. Tudor has been sleeping in a van so that he can keep an eye on his property and keep looters away. And today, he's been keeping an eye on the forecast. We've got a major, major job cut out for ourselves, and uh, then the rain now is going to make that more complicated. For somebody to take advantage of people, it just, you know, got a bunch of us riled up, and we decided we were just going to, you know, come out here and do something about it. Using some donated equipment, the squad is focused on debris removal here, but they do all kinds of work. There's something out here that somebody can do for you, and uh, we're going to do it for free of charge. Now, if you want to give us a donation to the squad, we'll take it, but, you know, no pressure. And whatever burdens they can't lift, they're glad to share. In Madison County, Carla Wade, ABC 36 News. About 30 men and women make up the Madison County Rescue Squad. It was formed in response to the tornado outbreak in April of 1974, which was responsible for seven deaths in Richmond. That is going to do it for this ABC 36 News update. Be sure to check out more stories, weather, and sports at WTVQ.com.